Okay, so I started creating this show a month ago. Hundreds could turn up. Do you, do you two have just arrived? It's just finished. <laughs> <laughs> What have you been drinking? <laughs> it's taken me a month to create this. I'm still fine tuning things to the last few hours before. I know I hate being documented. What are you doing? Just explain what you're doing. I'm taking these fixtures down for a rehearsal for tonight because then tomorrow it's show day. Put the thumbs up. I've got six moving heads in the windows. They'll be clear of anyone. There'll be cables running inside, but they will be taped up. And then my haze is going to be in the middle currently, unless the wind says otherwise. That would be very awkward. Yeah, so the fires are going to light the house up and make it really bright. Alright, so this is the house where I'm going to have six moving heads going through the windows facing towards the audience. And then I'm going to run more cable to my um, battens, which are going to run in a big line across the front which is going to be quite good for some certain effects. And it'll work as a blinder as well. It seems like bad, but I'm going to try my best to not make anything a tripping hazard, so I'll cable it all safely. Um, this obviously has strobe lighting, especially in the finale bit of the show. Um, so I've made signs which are going to go up, and before the show there's going to be an announcement which goes over through the speakers to let everyone know that there's going to be flashing lights. Um, I'm currently checking the weather because in previous years I've gotten quite unlucky with it but tomorrow it's looking like it's going to be clear and low winds so pretty much perfect conditions which is quite satisfying. I'm being taken to the venue by the chauffeur. <laughs> you're, like, you're like the yeah. transit van guy. <laughs> I'm you're the man with a van. <laughs> you're the man with a van taking all the gear. It's going to be stressful, obviously. Got my spider up this morning. Lots, hundreds could turn up. I don't know really? how. Well, I don't know how wide it's gone. Oh, well, it'd be good. You'd get a bit of a reputation, wouldn't you, yeah. for doing this sort of things? Just mind, mind the bushes, sweetie. I will. Thank you. Yeah, mind Lisa's bushes. Oh, I didn't say it like that deliberately. <laughs> Why is it stressful? Because last year when I did it, I wired the whole rig backwards, so <laughs> <laughs> it was quite, it was not great. Right now I'm placing the lights in the places that I uh, put them on the rig plan. How long do you reckon it takes to set the external up? Hour or so. Ten minutes before the show I realised I had done that, so I've got a build on that and not rig it backwards this time. And we get a few people watching, obviously family, friends, etc. And a few people coming along thinking, what the hell's going on down there? The house is lit up. But he's not lit it up in this way before. Word's got about that this light show is going on. So we're expecting quite a few people tonight, which is going to be quite scary. So I don't know how feels about that. Any other issues that might come up? Um, general tech issues, sound not working. Everything should work. It all worked last night. Looks all right. What happens if you get a power cut? Don't even start because that will just add on to my list of oh god, <laughs> <laughs> everything that can go wrong. It'll be alright. Looking forward to it. Looking forward to it? Yeah, it's been a whole year since I did one. Years today. Rory, it's just to stand there like that, right at the end of the road. You're not going to be part of the show. Yeah, no, can't you. You literally. Actually, you can go stand on the other side of the town. <laughs> Alright, sound checked out. I think they set up outside. Just setting up inside now, he just wants to do a sound check. So I've got on the other side of the road. So we've got speakers now down here. Yeah. Alright, so I'll go and stand on the other side of the road, yeah? Yeah. Okay. What a tune! What a tune! That is so cool. Yeah, uh, yeah. The system is not amazing. No offense to your speakers. What's wrong with those speakers? That's how you do. Why don't you get a picnic table out? That's horrible. So, no, I need it to MacBook, literally just for the MacBook to go on because the cable is like a foot too short. I've got my face on yet. What? You ain't got your face on? No. Please. I thought that was your face. How do you know? They're not, they're not going to get any signal. They'll just take a sec. Oh. Two things have gone wrong. What's gone wrong? Um, I placed all them lights backwards. By accident. You put backwards. That's because from when I rehearsed it yesterday, I had them all facing the other way that they are now. Okay. And I, it didn't quite go through my mind that it were actually facing that way, not that way. 
Right, we've just done a, uh, well Finlay's just done a, a sound check and a lighting check. Um, I think I'm ready. I've just checked uh, video wise, uh, so we're going to set up two cameras. We're going to have the 14 to 30 on a tripod set directly out front. We've got the whole house in, so we're going to capture absolutely everything. Sound light, everything working alright? Um, I'm going to also use a um, 70 to 200 to basically segregate bits of tonight and capture that. Sounds always, sounds always a fun one. <laughs> Um, audience, people watching, Hello. and also place sections of the house and lighting, etc. So, yeah, it's Halloween and everyone's here. That's going to be awesome. Good luck. To the waves, babe. I know that you want it to. It's a risk worth taking, even if it's over soon. Want you skin tight, close like denim. Come on, love me. Your body close to mine Call me if it's only for tonight Your hands on my body Cause my body's what you like Great video for you, man. Isn't it just? Oh. <laughs> On you. No, stop! <laughs>